Hello, my friends, and welcome back to another episode of Sky Factory 3.0. Today's episode number 23, and it's all about inventory control. What are we going to do with it? I got the googly eyes tonight. Ah! <laughs> googly eyes. They are so cool. All right, yeah, we are going to do we're going to do inventory control today, and we just have so much. We need to consolidate all this and get things cleaned up a little bit. I, it's, it's, you have to come over here and continuously make sure all this is taken care of. It's just, it's just getting to be a pain in the, you know what. So we are going to take care of that. We're going to take all the stuff from the chickens. We're going to take everything that's coming from the, uh, actually from the sieves that go through here, all this stuff. And we're going to put some chests over here and make ourselves a nice little storage area, I believe. And I believe the first thing we need is going to be ender chest. We haven't messed with ender chest yet. So let's go ahead and look that up. I got the stuff supplies ready. Ender chest. There we go. And we're going to do this bad boy right here. And it's not too hard. Uh, I have everything in my inventory. I just need to put it where it belongs. So we're going to build three of these things. So we go. Whoops. Yeah, you have to take half, 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 and half there. And then that. I don't know if I got this right or not, but we'll check. Da, 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 da. And a three chest, right? Three chest. And I think it has some chest here. Got two. We'll throw two in there for now, and I'll go get another one in just a second. I got some down here. This thing has turned out really, really good. It has made my life so much easier. I mean, look at the inventory. I mean, you just, you can't beat that. Can't beat it at all. Got one more chest here. And put one back. Take one out. There we go. And that makes three. And we're going to have ender chest. And that will help get consolidate a lot of this stuff. Okay. So we got three of these. Extra, extra obsidian. And we're also going to build something else. It's going to be a um, a compactor. Auto 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 compressor. Auto auto. Let's see right here. Auto packager. Packager. There we go. And it's not too hard to build. And the only problem with it, you have to have power with it. And I'll try to explain it. We need three pistons. And, yep, three pistons. What do I need for that? Uh, I need everything over here in this inventory over here. You know, let's go here, here. Put everything over here. And I have this. I can go ahead and put the cobblestone here, and I can go ahead and put that. So there we go. Let's make three pistons. One, two, three. And what else do we need? We need. That's it. So we have. I want to build two of these things. I don't know why I didn't bring enough over. I should have another one here. Let's see. Why can't I bring another one? Just build another one. I needed six of these. Ah! ah, 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 ah. Okay. Let's try this again. One, two, three. And now I should have everything for another another one. There we go. We got two auto packers. And I'll explain because I'm, I'm planning on putting an auto packer here and an auto packer there. And an auto packer, well, it's better if I try to explain it, show you. Okay. So just go ahead and take this one here. We're going to break this and this. And I'm going to put this. No, 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 no. Not that one. We're going to put this there and put the auto packer there. Now the auto packer, it has to have a chest on the left hand side and on the right hand side. And it's automatically, with the way you put it in, the left hand, the left -hand side is the input, the right hand side is the output. The problem is I have no chest down there, so I'm going to have to move this one down. So let me figure out how I'm going to do that and I'll be right back. Alright, I have put another chest down here in the bottom. And I'm just doing insert on both sides. Yeah, well, I got some from the alloy smelter already. So one thing's going in. Now I have to get all the other stuff that was in one chest and move it to the new chest. So I'm going to take all this stuff. Just break this here. Now, if I just break it, everything will pour everywhere. So I can't do that. So I'm going to take a few minutes and I am going to put everything down in this chest. So give me just a few minutes and I'll be right back. All right, I believe that's the last of it. I got everything moved down. We'll sort it. There we go. We can go ahead and break this one now. Let me go ahead and put this block back. Good there. And I can go ahead and break this. There we go. 
And now I need to just add power to this and we should be all set. And what it's going to do, actually just go ahead and right click on it. If you right click on it, it now says 2x2 two two or then 3x3. Three three. Now this can be dangerous because if you do a 2x2 two two iron, you get all these trap doors and we really don't want a bunch of trap doors. So you hit shift and then right click on it and now you 2x2 two two only. It's a 3x3 three three only. That's all we want, 3x3. Three three. So it's going to take a 3x3 three three pattern and then make a block out of it. That's the whole point, and then it'll transfer it over to our ender chest. That is the whole, yep, three by three only. And I can go ahead and sort that again. And let's get some power and we'll see it start working. Let's get some power. Some energy conduit, there we go. And we have energy right here, so that's not a big deal. And now we can go ahead and look in the ender chest and you can see it's, or it's already starting to compact all this up. And everything is looking lovely, lovely, very pretty, <laughs> lovely. All right, we're going to do the same thing over here in our chicken farm. And we're also going to send all its stuff into an ender chest. And the same same pattern ender chest, because the top of it has all white, we're going to do the same thing. So we're going to go from here to here to here. There we go. So now we're going to put this thing right here. And now we need to put another chest. I don't have it on me. I'll just make one real quick. No, no, I'm, I'm not even thinking right. We're going to do the ender chest, Greg. Ender chest right here. So now we'll go from here to here to here. And the only thing I have to worry about in this one, we're going to go ahead and right shift. Uh, let's get an empty hand. Right shift click on it. We're going to do three by three. And I think... The only thing I have to worry about is string. And I don't have any string, so I don't have to worry about that. Because string 3x3 three three will make a um, the sieve screens. And we don't want to do that. So string will go into strings. Yeah. So let's go down here and put some power to this. And I've got it close, but didn't know where I was going yet. So here we go. Let's go the rest of the way. And now it should also be adding to it. Yep, there we go. And we'll go up and look at it. Yeah, it's doing these things. So we'll end up doing them twice. Because it goes from nuggets to ingots, then we'll do the ingots into blocks. So we'll take those out of here in just a few minutes and make blocks out of those. But it is processing everything now. Let's just go ahead and get that. It is processing everything from here over to here. So now in my ender chest, wherever we put this third one, we're going to have everything right here ready to go. All right, so where are we going to put the third one, you ask? Good question. And I just lost it. Is it going? Yep, there it is. And it's sorted again. There we go. Need some more snowballs. So I got my snowball factory going. My chickens. That is one cold thing to uh, poop out. All right, let's get back over here. I am going to put the ender chest over here somewhere. Let's see, I'm planning on putting a row right here of drawers. And I want to keep, let's see, let's say right here we'll put our ender chest. There we go. We'll have a walkway through and we'll put our drawers right here. Yep, 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 right here. All right, so all my ender chests, everything is coming right here. Now we need drawers to put them into and sort them. So let me take a few minutes. Um, I'll build, I, you, you've seen me do the drawers over there, so let me go ahead and build some drawers real quick, and I'll be right back, and we'll place them down. All right, be right back. All right, I got all the drawers, and you can see the chest is filling up pretty good. So I got all the drawers. All we need now is to hardwire it with the item conduit, So I'm gonna go, and we need to lock them. Remember, always to lock these things, because we want to control exactly what goes into them. We don't want them just to go hodgepodge and go crazy. So what we're going to do is lock them all up. Now nothing can go into it once we turn on the system. Only thing can go into them is things that we once we place something into it, and then it will go into them. Now on the back, let's go ahead and break this right here. See if I can get the one right underneath this. There we go. And what I'm going to do now is I actually I can go behind here. I'll I'll go underneath in a little while. And basically I'm going to do all these and set them up for insert only. I'll do one real quick and then we'll come back. So it's just, in, oops, I went the long way. So I'm going to set all these like that for insert only. And as soon as I get that done, I'll come right back. All right, let's take a look and see where we are. Our chest has gotten a lot better, a lot emptier. 
Um, I actually got some snowballs I need to take out of here. And yeah, things look a lot better than they were before. Um, we also have, let's take a look at the one here at the smeltery. Everything now is actually in here. So everything that was like filling up. Now I do have some, I have to empty out here. It's not all the goods. I still have some stuff over there in the, those shelves, which I will transfer over also. But look at the smeltery. I mean, it was down to like this level down here full of, of, of ingots. So yeah, it is now under control a lot better. Now I'm just going to take a few minutes. I'm going to organize where I want to place this stuff. For example, I know I want, um, where's my diamond blocks? I want my diamond blocks and my iron blocks. Yep, right here. I made two big shelves for them, uh, drawers for them. One here, one here. So now automatically, if they're in here, they'll automatically be fed into here. And oh, don't forget, we got, we'll got we do that in a minute, the quantity number. And then over here, I know I want uh, my redstone. Where's my redstone? I don't have any redstone yet, but let me get the, the rest of the blocks in here, like the redstone and stuff, and we'll start feeding it. And uh, I'll show you when I get everything put in here, and I'll show you how it all works. All right, I'll be right back. All right, this is the final product. We have everything here. I believe everything. Most of the stuff is actually getting sent over here. Some of the stuff I brought over manually, like the string, because it's not going to be compressed with the uh, auto packer. So I did bring some of the stuff over manually, but this is everything. I sort it kind of like by color, but most of this is all my metals. And yeah, you can see my chest. It's basically got nothing in it now. And my other two chests are looking really, really good. We already took a look at them once before that's just wonderful and then here even better let's go ahead and look at this real quick now i need to do some um void uh upgrades for these things like i got uh, this stuff just needs to start voiding so i'll do a void upgrade off the of camera and so this is this is a lot better i mean there's just hardly anything in here now and i, I don't expect that i'll have to come over here and clean this up at all anymore so that is a positive positive thing yay all right, my friends, that ends today's episode. It's all about basically the ender chest and the auto packer. And yeah, we got all our storage in our one little area here. This is going to become my little crafting area. So I should have all my, my inventory here, my crafting table, uh, my machines. This is where everything is going to go from this point on. All right, my friends, make sure if you saw something you like, you give me that thumbs up. If you see something you didn't like, give me the thumbs down. It's good either way. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. It's been real, it's been fun, and it has been really fun. See you next time, my friends. Ah! Bye, guys.